forget the Grammys. Everyone knows the Grammy after parties are where it's at. If it is trench foot, that is. I think the rain actually deterred a lot of people from coming because the turnout uh, celebrity-wise at these after parties wasn't like huge. Oh, come on. SZA's label had a party that had French Montana and Chris Brown. Billie Eilish had one with Paris Hilton and Julia Garner. Affinity Nightlife had one with this guy. Okay, so it wasn't the best turnout this year, but the stars did go to the pre-parties, including the legendary Clive Davis party, which was attended by none other than... How was it? It was insane, man. Cher, Tom Hanks, Meryl Streep. Anybody under 65? Of course! For every Smokey, there was a Serena. For every Dion, there was a Dua. For every Stevie, there was a Stallion. Ice Spice performed. And then I just pants at Meryl Streep watching Ice Spice, and she's just like bouncing along. Meryl's super hip! In fact, her daughter's married to Mark Ronson. My best picture was Mariah Carey, who, by the way, walks around with someone who when you want a selfie, holds up a light. Get out, I love that! Did you get one? Yeah, it's so much better than all the other pictures. That checks out. So, looks like you didn't miss much at the after party, celebrities. Well, except the open bar and free food. Not that anyone at the Grammys would have wanted that. Can I just tell you, without getting specific, Ozempic went all the way through that room. Weight loss is in this year. It's out in this room, but it's in this <laughs> <laughs> He's not wrong. Now bump us out of here, Meryl!